Hey guys, Chris Ray here. Today I wanted to show you a little project I've been working on. Let's check it out. So about nine months ago, I moved to Harrisburg, Pennsylvania to attend Penn State Harrisburg. Whenever I moved, I didn't have as much workspace as I did before. So I ended up getting one of these. Now this thing has been really awesome. I've used it almost every day since I moved. The only problem I have is for a portable soldering iron, I wasn't able to take it anywhere. Eventually, I decided to buy one of these so I could take it with me. I was planning on building a cutoff circuit for this so I could use it with the iron, but then I got a DeWalt drill for Christmas. I was using this drill one day when I realized the battery that comes with this drill is basically the same thing as these LiPo batteries a lot of people in the community have been using. The only difference being the uh, battery's chemistry. So once I started to think about it, I realized there's no point to carry this around with me anymore because I have this. Now after a couple hours of designing, I came up with this. This can plug right on to the DeWalt 20 volt max batteries. Then all you need is one of these cables. Plug it in and turn on the power. Now this is only my first prototype. I printed this case out with a 0.8 mil nozzle, so it's not exactly the nicest. The internals are just your simple cutoff circuit. I've already redesigned the circuitry to include a USB charger along with all this. So if you have to go on iFixit or anything like that, your phone will be nice and charged up. I will be uploading the instructions for this on Instructables as well as the case on Thingiverse. For the second design that I came up with, I actually thought about getting some custom circuit boards manufactured and making a little kit for anybody who's new to soldering or wants a nicely made one of these that they can just solder together through whole parts and just use. Usually whenever I'm prototyping little circuits, I use perf board like this. Uh, however, to get the cutoff circuitry, and the 5 volt buck converter circuitry all installed, I don't think I'm going to be able to use this. I am going to have to get circuit boards printed off. If you guys or anyone that you know might be interested in a kit like this, uh, let me know. Leave it down in the comments. Uh, if I get enough people, I'll probably try and get something together. I should point out this doesn't only work with DeWalt. Uh, it should work with any 20 volt lithium ion battery, whether it's a power pack or any kind of drill battery. I would also consider making an 18 volt version for the 18 volt drill batteries that are pretty common. Uh, really it depends on what people want and what people ask for. It wouldn't take too long to drop some plans for a, a different form factor, like maybe make for Ryobi. So yeah, like I said, let me know what you guys think. If you're interested in one, leave it down in the comments. Uh, if we get enough people together, I'll let you guys know how you can pick one up. Thanks for watching.